Well, if you were charged with a violation of the governor's COVID executive orders past April 30th of last year, you're now in the clear. The Wayne County prosecutor is opting to throw them all out, even if they had already been adjudicated. Mara McDonald is live at the Frank Murphy Hall of Justice. Mara, uh, Kim Worthy believes her office has no, no choice here, really. Kimberly, that's right. She believes the, no, the law no longer supports it. So let me show you why. For months last year, Governor Gretchen Whitmer was churning out COVID-19 executive orders, but the Michigan Supreme Court ruled she overstepped her authority. The Emergency Management Act, which she was using, only allowed those orders to continue past April 30th if she had legislative approval, which she did not. All over the state, people were ticketed with violating those orders. Take a look. These are the pending and already adjudicated cases of people who have COVID violations in Wayne County. Tonight, Prosecutor Kim Worthy is dismissing all of it. After all, if the underlying executive order is not valid, how can these cases possibly continue? Worthy saying tonight, quote, Governor Whitmer's leadership has prevented many of our citizens from contracting COVID-19. However, considering the Supreme Court's decision, WCPO will no longer use criminal prosecution to enforce the governor's executive order. Back here live, don't be surprised if you see other county prosecutors follow suit. We're live at the Frank Murphy Hall of Justice tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Yeah, okay, Mara, thank you.